This question is to find the derivative of a complex function where both the base and exponent involve the variable x. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel Math Tutor 8285. Your subscription fuels the passion. Let's grow together. Thank you so much. Let f of x equal tangent x raised to the power cosine x, where x is between 0 and pi over 2. Which of the following is the correct derivative of f of x? There are four options. First step, we start by taking logarithms to simplify. We rewrite the function by saying, the natural log of f of x equals cosine x multiplied by the natural log of tangent x. Key idea. When both the base and the exponent involve x, logarithmic differentiation is the most effective approach. Next step, we differentiate both sides. The derivative of the left side is f prime of x divided by f of x. On the right side, the derivative of cosine x is negative sine x. So we get negative sine x times natural log of tangent x. Then, from the product rule, we also add cosine x times the derivative of natural log of tangent x. The derivative of natural log of tangent x is secant squared x divided by tangent x. So the entire derivative becomes f prime of x over f of x equals negative sine x times natural log of tangent x plus cosine x times secant squared x over tangent x. Common mistake. Many students forget to apply the chain rule when differentiating the natural log of tangent x. Then, next step, simplify the expression. Notice that secant squared x divided by tangent x simplifies to cotangent x. So the formula becomes f prime of x over f of x equals negative sine x times natural log of tangent x plus cosine x times cotangent x. After that, next step is to multiply back by f of x. Multiplying both sides by f of x gives f prime of x equals tangent x to the power cosine x multiplied by the expression in parentheses which is negative sine x times natural log of tangent x plus cosine x times cotangent x. Next step, match with the answer choices. Looking carefully, this matches exactly with option D. Final answer, the correct choice is D. Whenever an exponent depends on x, use logarithmic differentiation to untangle the problem. It always simplifies the process and prevents mistakes. That's it for this question solving. This video is based on our math tutoring blog and class recordings. Hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe to our channel Math Tutor 8285 and turn on the notification bell. Press the like button. Your subscription fuels the passion. Let's grow together. Thank you so much.